In this video, I'll present the high-level strategies for approaching data science with DevOps. It is easy to get caught up in the technological solutions when it comes to DevOps. There are a lot of interesting tools that can make our life easier. But you should start with the process, the high-level strategy you'll take for tackling data with DevOps. Then the platform comes second. The day-to-day -day tools and jobs will come after you have your high-level approach taken care of. Now, it's easy to lose sight of the wider view once you get into the day-to-day -day workings, but once you have everything in place, make sure you do take a step back to consider the overall process every so often. So what does the process culture look like for data science with DevOps? Well, in an open and connected environment, you need to secure each step in a way that doesn't leak secret or confidential information. So you have a build phase, an integration phase, and a deployment phase, and you iterate these. So you need to make sure your organizational secrets and your client and customer data is all secured along the way. And this process culture has to be ingrained from the start. In this build, integrate, deploy process, and the iteration of this, building models, integrating them, and then improving the results by iterating or rebuilding based on new information, this is the process that requires our DevOps to improve and automate. This culture is what benefits from our tactical elements, but the overall process must be there from the start. Now, I do talk about strategy and tactics when it comes to DevOps. It's a chess analogy that I use for this. In chess, you're trying to move and take pieces until you ultimately checkmate your opponent. The strategy is your positional play and how you approach the game, or the structural component of the game. The tactics are the individual moves to grab pieces from your opponent. Placing your bishop in a position that forks the king and queen is a tactic, so the king has to move, and then you can grab the queen. In DevOps and data science, I like to describe my approach in these terms as well. Strategy is a high-level structure of your approach, and the tactics are the day-to-day -day jobs, tools, and actions you take. So you might have high-level goals like minimizing downtime, iterating quickly, collaborative development, and being able to respond to failure. For more on the tactical goals, I'll cover those in the video titled Data DevOps Tactics. Another way I like to put this is planning versus agility. With DevOps for data science, your plan is not a blueprint. You can think of it as a compass of where you'd like to go. It's the strategic direction, but it's not set in stone. In a working environment, you'll make changes and respond to challenges that modify and change this along the way. As long as you don't lose sight of the high-level goals, that's okay. In terms of agility, this refers to quick movements, the tactical iteration of tasks. In planning, you might determine certain aspects of your approach requires automation, and others might need human approval or intervention. The tactical or agile approach is exactly how this is implemented and carried out. Planning is the high level, and agility refers to the details. Now, before you get into the technological pieces of your DevOps, Look at the overall goals first, what you'd like to achieve, and then move on to the platform itself. So the platform follows from the process. And that concludes this presentation on data DevOps strategies.